just couple of hours ago you were talking about uh, this is golden is uh, in kali yuga and sela prapad mentioned uh, you know iskan is his body and iskan temples are uh, vaikuntas so what do you think in next uh, coming decades or even centuries what you know we as an organization can contribute to the whole world Sri <clears throat> Prabhupada's mission is the fulfillment of Srimad Bhagavatam's predictions of a spiritual revolution to enlighten mankind in the darkest age. And Sri Prabhupada said without giving a specific reference it is said that there will be a 10000 year golden age mm. within the kali yuga the reference we found later in the rama vaivarta purana which clearly indicates the effect of Lord Chaitanya's appearance in the mission of someone who would follow him by 500 years mm. and in that Brahma Vaivarta Purana Ganga Devi herself says I mean Krishna himself says in response to her question that in 5000 years this is krishna speaking in dwarka mm. i will send my mantra upasaka mm. one who worships me in the form of my mantra what mantra hare krishna hare krishna hare krishna krishna, 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 krishna hare 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 rama hare rama 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 hare hare because ganga devi's concern was that with the advent of kali yuga people would adhere to this one vedic principle to take bath in holy rivers and holy places but neglect the other principles accompanying that that you hear from the sadhus and follow their instructions so ganga devi aware of the predictions in the 12th canto of shrimad bhagavatam could discern that in the kali yuga people would of india would take bath in her holy waters just to wash off their sins but not engage in any purificatory principles so that would result in her being overly burdened and polluted the sinful toxic reaction and not being able to offer any benefit in return mm. so she begged krishna the blessing to go underground until the end of the kali yuga when sakti yuga dawns and she would flow back to the surface to serve a more civilized world and lord krishna told her no because in 5000 years which would not be the appearance of lord chaitanya mm. it would be the time when shiva prabhupada appeared mm. my mantra upasaka will gather devotees from around the world mm. bring them to your shore and when they bathe in your waters they will counteract by their purity they will counteract the sinful reactions washed off in your waters by these degraded souls of kali yuga so stay until that time to serve the mission of my mantra upasaka which will inaugurate the dawn of a golden age which will last for 10000 years after which kali yuga again resumes full force at which time 
you can fulfill your aspiration to go underground mm. and wait until the Satyug to surface again. Mm. And that coincides with Srila Prabhupada's instructions that his books would be the law for that 10,000 year period. And when you say Iskhan is his body, the books are his heart. Yes. As is the Holy Dham. In this way, everything is synthesized. Mm. In a perfect spiritual renaissance to save the world from the darkness that would otherwise drag everyone down to a hellish condition. Very nicely said, Maharaj. And one of the best books I read this year is, uh, you know, this book. Uh, so please tell a few words about this book, as you are the author of this book. In attempting to fulfill Srila Prabhupada's ardent desire to have a replica of Vrindavan in the West, after Srila Prabhupada departed this world, We were lost in every way, mm. especially in how to reveal the Holy Dawn here without Srila Prabhupada's presence. It didn't take but hours to realize that Srila Prabhupada hasn't left us. Mm. He has come to us in another form, in Vipralamba mm. Seva, service and separation in which there's the added dimension of a deeper union paradoxically and that the structure we were building for his residence which came to be known as Srila Prabhupada's Palace of Gold mm. was actually unbeknownst to us becoming his first Smriti Samadhi in the world. Mm. So Srila Prabhupada is with us in Samadhi and directing us how mm. to serve him. And as we take his instructions to heart and attempt with sincerity to fulfill them, in this speci specific case, revealing the Holy Dham, the Dham reciprocates. Mm. She's Krishna's energy. She's his consort. She's our mother. Mm. And she reciprocates with our attempts to serve and in the most wonderful ways, mm. which Srila Prabhupada inaugurated when he was here with us physically, but continues to do so, revealing the holy places. Mm. And this is a type of communion and reciprocation which is too wonderful to express in words mm. or pictures. Mm. So we combine the words with pictures <laughs> and histories yes. and testimonies to try to convey just what the title says. Appreciating the Vrindavan Dham, yes. her beauty and glory, message and grace. And in that way, to extend Srila Prabhupada's divine grace yes. in the form of the Holy Dham, which is the outer manifestation of his heart and is tremendously helpful mm -hmm. in assisting the spreading of the holy name, especially in the West, and the purification of our hearts, and the realization that this world is not our home. The Holy Dom is an expansion of our homeland, mm. descended on earth to prepare our consciousness for returning back. 
thank you so much maharaj and uh, i'm very uh, uh, you know blessed and honored to sit at the at this place this is radha kund and shyama kund and radha gopinath at the foot of govardhan hill govardhan hill uh, such a wonderful uh, you know space uh, uh, those in those instructions were within shri la prabhupad's very first guidance for this community in 1968 before he even visited here wow. he said specifically wow develop radhakun shamakun govardhan and the six temples the seven temples of the six goswamis thank you so much uh, whenever i come here it's all you know prabhu's mercy and uh, uh, and your mercy to develop these wonderful places and thank you so much for giving the time today evening thank you so much thank hare you krishna so much. hare krishna